What's up guys, I'm Noah, and for today's reaction video, I'm reacting to Love XO again. This one's called Smart Girl Pretends to be Dumb to Fit In at School. She instantly regrets it. Yeah. <laughs> this is pretty interesting. Smart Girl Pretends to be Dumb to Fit In at School. Yeah, I don't think you want to do that. I don't think you want to do that at all. That's not a good idea. It doesn't even sound like a good idea. Like, really, do you think, can you, like, say that in your head and then, like, think that's a good idea? I don't think so. But, we will see. I mean, it seems like an interesting idea because there's definitely people who do it. There's definitely people who do it. Sadly enough. But people don't know any better. I mean, I guess this is what the video is for. For people who don't know any better. So for people who don't know any better and now they can learn so they don't do this. So yeah, I'm pretty sorta interested. <laughs> so without further ado, let's get into the video. Dude, did you hear that Mr. Stevenson is canceling the test because he got a migraine again? Seriously? I know, bum right? Yeah, we studied so hard for it. I was so ready. I say we should go to the library to work. Okay, I'm sorry, what? He canceled the whole test because he got a migraine? Man, I wish I had that teacher, bro. Like, oh, I didn't study. Hey, I have a great idea. How about <laughs> we get this dude a migraine? No, <laughs> I wouldn't do that. Of course I would not, but hopefully if, hopefully if that one week that I didn't study, I did, the teacher gets a migraine. Thankfully, thankfully, thankfully that happened. Cause now I can study longer, so yeah. On our speech and debate topic, we have our Lincoln Douglas tournament this Friday. Good idea. <laughs> They're so pretty. Yeah, pretty dumb. I wish I were that confident. Ignorance really is bliss. Confidence? <laughs> Unless you were confident to be dumb? What? I don't know. I don't even know. If somebody can explain. So we have an extra seat in the limo for prom. Who should we invite? Oh my god. We should see if we can get in the limo. What? That would mean us having dates first. Oh, and losing about 100 IQ points in order to sustain a conversation with them. No thank you. Come on, it'd be fun. We can go together. This is our last chance. Man, like, since I don't know, like, how rude they are right now, it seems like they're the rude ones right now because they're just the only ones that are throwing out chats right now. So, I guess we'll see. We'll see. Chance to experience what it's like to be cool before we go off to UC Davis. I'm cool? I don't know. They seem boring. They look fun to me. Hey, Gigi. Um, hi. I don't know if you remember me. I sat next to you in homeroom last year. My name oh, is. Oh, right. You're that intensely smart girl. Intensely. Thanks. <laughs> intensely smart. How can? How does that even work? I don't even know. It wasn't know. a compliment. But okay. I mean. <laughs> Really, it doesn't matter if it's a compliment or not. You can take it how you will. Like, if you take it kindly, then good for you. That is really good. Like, that is exactly how you should take it. Like, you shouldn't take anything really negatively unless it helps you. So, no. Take that. If she's like, oh, you're intensely smart. Like, she may think, she may want to, <laughs> she, she may want to offend you, but honestly you can take that as you will like basically what she said was you were smart and that's a compliment you should take that oh um yeah right um well really i'm like actually not that smart i just read what? okay now i get the title but why why actually no i do know why because she wants to fit in not to school but to fit into those group of Girls, popular girls, whatever, etc., etc. So, yeah, that is, that is totally dumb, <laughs> totally dumb. I mean, 
which kind of makes sense, but come on now, you don't need to do that. You don't. You're better off, like, not being with those those people. You're good. Um, anyways, I heard you were looking for someone to fill a spot in your limo. And? Well, we and? haven't booked our limo yet, so we thought we could do you a favor and fill that spot. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's only only for one couple. Well, that's the great thing about us. <laughs> there are two of us. Two people. Some would call that a couple. Um, I don't know if you guys fit in with our aesthetic. Aesthetic? word for you. Dang. I'm sorry, did you say- <laughs> That's funny, that's funny. Say something, nerd? Yeah. No, she didn't. Oh, uh, yeah, she did. And she was right. <laughs> she sneezed. She has allergies, yeah. Um, we really need to get that under control. Do you want a Benadryl, Tina? I, I don't no. know. No! And she also suffers from amnesia. No! Um, anyway, we'd love to fill that spot. <laughs> Maybe. Well, so not only is she trying to fit in, but she's being rude to her true friend. So, no. That's a no-go. Think about it. <laughs> Did you hear that? They said they'll think about it. No, nope. I didn't hear that. Must have been my amnesia. Why did you treat me like that in front of them? They were being so no, mean. No, they weren't. You just what? don't know how to talk to them. Steph. Hey, please, just do this for me. Fine. You gotta have my back, though. You can't just leave me hanging like that, okay? I promise. Maybe we should cool it on that for a while. What? Your friendship? Handshake? Clap? <laughs> thing? <laughs> I don't, I don't think, I don't even know. <laughs> I don't know what to think of that. Like, that's pretty, it was pretty cool that they have like a secret handshake. But why? Why do you want to get rid of that? Just to fit in with the <laughs> cringe squad? No, you just, like, I don't know why you would want to do that. Like, do they have some benefits? Do they give you money or something? <laughs> like, what are the benefits of that? Everybody, I know you were excited to have your test today, but I think instead uh, I'm just going to have you quietly uh, review chapter six in your textbooks. So at least it'll give you the weekend study. Poor dude. Poor dude. Dude's just constantly having migraines, constantly having headaches, dude. I think you just need to take a break. Go on a vacation to the Bahamas or something. Like, sleep in. Because <laughs> clearly school ain't doing it for you, dude. <laughs> oh, sh oh, please, hold your applause. <sighs> Mr. Stevenson? Yes, Tina? Stephanie and I would like to use this time to go to the library and put our finishing touches on our debate speeches. Our, tur our tournaments on Friday. Wow, what a desperate nerd. Definitely not going in our limo. That's the only benefit. Wow, what a desperate nerd. She's definitely not going into our limo. Like, can you hear yourself? I'm sorry. I know it's, I know they're acting. I know they're acting. So nothing against them personally, of course, but man, come on, just hear, just, just come on. Oh, okay, okay, I'm over it, I'm over it. Is this true, Stephanie? You wanna go to library? Um, like, no, <laughs> totally not. I mean, I'd rather hang out and- No, <laughs> totally not. Like, who needs a limo, bro? Limos are boring if you're like, if you're not with your friends, you know? Like, how, why, why would I want to go on a limo with a whole bunch of people that I don't even like? 
Like, why would you want to do that? The vibe's just completely off. Their aesthetic is gonna be pretty bad, and I am gonna hate being in that limo. <laughs> Because other than that, it's better to go with your friends in a van than with a bunch of rando, rude chicks at in a limo. <laughs> okay? So, just letting, just putting that out there. Putting that out there. And I'll do boring stuff like studying or preparing for a debate. I don't even know what she's talking about. Okay, uh, well, Tina, you can go to the library by yourself. Here's your hall pass. Uh, poor dude. Why do you look like everything's hurting you? Why it look like... Why does it look like every single thing he does hurts him? He's like, oh, here's your hall pass. <laughs> here's your hall pass. Oh, I got a blink. Ah, oh, crap. Man, my eyes. Oh my gosh. Students right beside him. Oh, hang on. Ah, oh, yeah, what's up? <clears throat> Okay, okay, I'm sorry, dude. I'm sorry. Just go take a nap. You know, the day is almost over, dude. Then you can go home, take a nap, take a few... I don't know. Get a soup. Drink some tea. I don't know what can help you with your migraines, constant migraines. Maybe put some mice on it. I don't know. You already know. Actually, you know what? If all he needed was mice, he really could have just went to the nurse's office, bro. They are legends for that. Legends. You need some ice? You need some ice? You broke your leg? You need some ice? You need some ice? Your leg? Your leg hurts? You have a cramp? Get some ice. Your eye? It's bleeding? Get some ice. <laughs> your, your hair is coming out? Here's some ice. Hey! Do you want to sit with us? No. I'm um, like, yeah, totally. But honestly, honestly, if she did all of that, then you might as well. You might as well. If you're sacrificing your friendship, your <laughs> your smarts, your intelligence, then yeah, you might as well. You have nothing else to lose. So, what do you guys think about the color teal? Love. Worship. Trophy it? That's what I thought. So? Are you serious? Gorgeous. Beautiful. Yes. <clears throat> uh, can I speak to you, Stephanie? Um, yeah. Yeah, like sure, totally. I have all the research here for our debate this afternoon. Do you have your opening statement ready? Oh my god. Seriously? I thought we were going dress shopping today after school. Uh, well, we have a debate tournament. <laughs> no, we don't. We're going dress shopping. Yeah, loser. So get lost. Ah, uh, you hate to see it. You hate to see it. All right, guys, let's start for 30 minutes. You may read anything you like. Mr. Travis? Yes? Here's a note from Ms. Hernandez. What is that loser doing here? Stephanie, she is not coming with us in our limo. You need to find a real date, and it better be someone cool, and not lame like her. Stephanie Hamilton, the bus is ready to take you to the debate tournament. I thought you were going dress shopping with us. Thank you. Oh, what a clumsy nerd. Look at her. Maybe you should have calculated your steps better. Stop it, Gigi. Leave her okay. alone. Okay, that that was funny. That was funny. That was good. That was good. Okay, but seriously, she just dropped her books. Like, it takes like five seconds to pick it back up. Like, coming up. Like, you're being real extra. <laughs> Mind your business. Coming out. Right in your own limo with a whole bunch of your fake friends while I help my friend out. 
That's the that's a decent thing that I can do. Clearly, you have no sense of doing it, right? Like helping people. What is that? <laughs> Just because she's smart and prepared doesn't make her lame or less cool. We like to try our best. We like to study, to read, to get yeah. good grades. Exactly. What are you doing? On top of that, we like to help people. We like to be nice. And yeah, we don't need your crummy limo. Like, it's probably, <laughs> it's probably gonna break down anyway. It's like, come I on. I swear now. to God, if you don't stop talking to me like this, you will not be in our limo. <laughs> you know what? I swear to God, if you don't stop talking to me like this, like the end of the world, the end of the world that I can't be in your limo. Like, the end, it's the end of the world. The sky is falling because I'm not in your limo. Wow, wow. I don't even care because one day. We will be so successful that you will be the one begging us for a ride in our limo. Hopefully, if I was successful, I wouldn't have a limo because I, I personally just don't like those. I don't like them. I like limos, but I don't like owning them. Like, yeah, sh being chauffeured is cool, but I like driving, so no, no, maybe, no, maybe not. Maybe something one time for fun. If I'm like with my friends or something, but no, other than that, mm -mm. that's just overrated. Ooh, not the ooze. Come on, let's go win that tournament. Okay, Gigi, take Awkward this to the silence. principal. What? Now. She was not expecting that. Honestly, I wasn't expecting it either. I wonder what he put on that note. But maybe for being rude or something. Yeah, probably that. Probably that. Yeah. Oh. That was it. Yeah. That was interesting. Um. The ending was kind of like mellow. I mean, she kind of learned her lesson. She stopped trying to dumb herself down just to fit in with the, that group of girls. I don't even know. And like, a lim for, just for a limo ride? Just for like one limo ride? Come on now. You're gonna ruin your friendship for one limo ride. No, not worth it at all. But yeah, that was interesting. I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you like, subscribe, post notifications so you never miss a video when I upload. And I'll see you guys.